Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Let's talk about it, man. Y'all know what time it is. Pop the balloon to find love, episode 13. We got to get right into it, man, because, yo, they got the women this time, man. You know we got to talk about them. We got to do our thing, man. We're going to judge people. That's what we do. We judge people. So here we go. Let's get right into it. Okay, skinny mini. And a leg tat. Okay. She got the purple on looking like Grimace. I got my purple on too. Uh oh, we'll see this one. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Mm -mm. Uh oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Go do the thing. Go do the thing, bitch. Just twirling that mic. All right, all right. Come on, man. Everybody got to get a walk through. Hype for this beat. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. They got some things in here today. Oh, yeah. Come on, hit us with the commercial. The same brewing tradition. So they always do. Every Start episode, your man. Start your legs. Hello, everyone, and welcome. Hold on, man. Before we get into this, yo, I got to say this. I got to be careful what I say. Um, These are people, sisters, wives, daughters, whatever, aunties. Cause um last time I did one, somebody reached out to me, and I'm glad I ain't said nothing wrong about it. It was number six, it was she said um, number six the the witch. Cause I called her a witch last time, because everybody was mesmerized by this woman. It's like yo, is she a witch? Everybody mesmerized, and she reached out. She was like yo, I like your commentary, blase blase. Um, I'm like okay, that's what's up. And I'm looking like oh shit, what did I say about her? So I gotta be careful, man. I'm still gonna be me. I'm still gonna say what I got to say, but I just ah, I don't know, man. Cause I ain't know these women be watching these shows, I, and I, I, I think about it. Maybe they do. It's like they hear people talk. They they watch the show. They want to hear what people got to say about them. The feedback. <clears throat> so um, not not them be careful. I just got to be mindful for what I say because these are people's peoples out here. You know, everybody got family and all this stuff. Um, and like I said, I'm glad I said something nice about the girl who reached out. Um, she had her own channel. She do her own thing. You know, whatever. But. I'm glad I said something nice because it could have been the easy. It could have been the other way around. It could have been like, oh, you didn't say this about me, brother. Let's get into the show, man. I know y'all tired of hearing me talk, but let's go. I'm back to my channel. It's your host, Arlette, and we are back with another episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love. Mm -hmm. And we've got some beautiful single ladies lined up. Make some okay. noise, ladies. Okay. <laughs> Stay is out there, man. I like these. Uh, okay, you guys look good and you sound good. Yeah, yes. So we are going to be bringing out some single guys one by one when they come around this corner. It's judgy you dudes, man. Come on. Him, you like everything. Like, do not pop your balloon. But if there's anything he said that's a red flag or, you know, maybe his fit's just not fitting, go ahead and pop the your fit balloon. Fitting. And then I'll go over to a few of you, see why you ended up popping. Are we ready? Let's roll up. Let's roll up. Okay. So with that being said, let's go ahead and bring out our first single guy. Hello, welcome Tropical in. Tropical Vortex, that's what I'm about to be. What's your name? Right I'm Scott. Scott, how old are you? Uh, I'm 32. Oh, Lord. Okay. And what do you do? Uh, I'm a truck driver, and uh, I'm living in Houston right now. Okay, I'm living very in Houston nice. right now. Now, uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? I like that little uh, skin dress. Play video games. Uh, well, Cheetah. Jaguar. Look, he played video games. Much. Oh, look, okay. look at his head. Other than that, playing video games. Got it. All right. Don't tell the hoes you want to play video moment. games. Uh, understanding, uh, kind, uh, kind lady that's like a real. Cause you know we all not perfect. So hey, if you're real, I'm real. We can talk. We can understand each other. And you want something it. real? Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, not real. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
Why you like? Why ain't nobody popped on him see. yet? They like him. They like him. Okay. All right. Let's take that. Yeah. Not too much. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. So we did get a few pop balloons. They keep looking over there. See why they, they keep the looking at him like, yeah, bro. Start right over here. If we can it's have all. your name and age. My name is Shayna, and I'm 30. Shayna. Shayna, what do you do? I'm an ultrasound tech, and I um act on the side too. Okay. You're acting. And so why did you end up popping your balloon? So he seems juice. like a very, very nice guy. Yeah. Um, I had to pop because you're a truck driver, you're on the road a lot, and the video games. I'm not sure how much you're into that. Yeah. Um, but you might be a gamer. Handsome, good looking. You seem very, very nice. So good luck. Uh, thank, thank you might be a gamer. <laughs> All right. Now, is she someone that's your type? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I love the curly hair. Natural. Thank you. you, thank know? you. Yeah. Pretty teeth. Oh, pretty, thank you. Pretty teeth. Yeah. <laughs> All right, perfect. Thank you. Let's go on down here. We can have your name and age. Hi, my name is Misha, and I'm 27. Um, the reason why, oh, oh. Misha, what do you do? What she built? So on. right now, oh, I actually uh, manage a family business that's been operating for about 25 years. Well, Waffle House. No, and why did you end up popping your balloon? So the reason that green why dress popped, disgusting um, was because right she did like she got on shaggy shirt from Scooby Doo. You know, be there a little bit more. Um, the truck driving, you're on the road a lot, so that's that's the reason. But very good looking, and I hope you find someone. That's very good looking. Thank you. All right, now same thing. Is she someone that's a hairline boy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. What makes her your type? Uh, I want to say, like it's just. It's just I could tell, you know. Okay. <laughs> no, no, she, no, she pretty. Thank you. Know? She pretty. Okay. Thank you. Let's okay. go on over here. Okay. Your name and age? My name is Miriam. I'm 34 years old. Okay. And what do you do? Ooh. I'm a hairstylist and a makeup artist. Hairstylist and makeup artist. Why did you end up popping your balloon? It was just the hair for me. <laughs> oh, hairing. Hair for me. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> What's wrong with the Show hair? her face. Show her. No, Show it her. just doesn't look done. Um, the hairline, you know, I just like somebody who looks clean, very, you know, put together. And... I feel like you gotta compliment me as well. So yeah, you ain't so, all is that. Someone that's your type. Uh, <laughs> yeah, this one, this. Yeah, one. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna. Uh, he is uh, mad. Yeah, she's my like type. That. Yeah, nah. Okay. She... You you hesitated a bit. Why'd you hesitate? Nah, I mean, nah. Because what I said. No, no. I can nah, line nah, you nah. up. You know. Hey. Uh, nah, nah. Hell yeah, nah. Okay. I would talk to. Her. All right, thank you. Let's go on to our next lady. Your name and age. Hi, I'm Zola Stone and I'm 31. Okay. And Zola, what do you do? I'm a recording artist and a traveling exotic dancer. You look so exotic. You the truck driving doesn't bother me at all. She's like a little fish or something. Why'd you end up popping your balloon? <laughs> she look no, I love Japanese the and on black. Your back. You know, got faith right here. I saw that. Um, it's just you're in Houston, I'm in LA, and I really don't want to do long distance anymore. I got you. You know, but I travel as well, but it's just. Yeah, the truck driving, it's, it's going to be a lot. Yeah, yeah. That's lonely, right? Yeah, that's why I'm yeah. on here. <laughs> yeah. But no, nah, no, nah, I understand. I mean, we, we do got a bad rep, too, so I, I, can't, no. I can't fault you. No, I mean, I'm a traveling exotic dancer, so it's yeah. like I'm traveling alone, too, and I have a bad rep. Okay. So. Not really, I'm mad. <laughs> yeah. no, I'm sorry. So now, is she someone that's your type? Uh, don't be mad at me. <laughs> nah. Okay, why not? Tattoo. Yeah. Mm, it's oh. too much. Nah, see, I'm cool with the body. She got a tattoo on the face. I'm sorry. I know. Yeah, you ain't want to date no biker. <laughs> Thank Get you. Get out of here. <laughs> Let's go on over here. Let's start with your name and age. She look like a, a, a bootleg. How did Ella's become the best bakery in Joy town? Joy Taylor. It all started with one smart decision. Welcome in. Come on, man. Truck from her Briante, uh, 27. Okay. And okay. what do you do? R&B singer. Yeah. R&B singer. <laughs> and so why did you end up popping your balloon? It's the style, you know. Um, yeah. Look at you! Style, you know. Okay. Everything you do is perfect, from the games to the working to everything. They dress nasty. Perfect, but um, it's it, the style for me. It's, it's cool. like you, did you put that on just to show that tattoo? <laughs> no, she's someone like You could have covered yeah. that up. That, that yeah. looked raggedy. That dress looked loose. And... <laughs> she got it. She got it. Oh. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Let's head on back. So we do still have... Ooh, four balloons left unpopped. I'm going to go ahead okay, and okay. switch it on over to you. Okay. I'm going to have you ask these ladies a question, help you narrow it down, see who's more your type. All right. Uh, where do you see yourself in two years? Two years, okay. We'll start with your name and age. My name is Jojo, and I'm 30. Jojo. And Jojo, what do you do? I'm a counselor and a professional dancer. Mm. So where do you see yourself in two years? 
in two years. Got like four uh, on that head. Still be in my career. Um, but she got like a. Hopefully, like a in a relationship uh, <laughs> in two years and. Uh, uh-uh. You know, reaching more goals. Being she like she look you dead in your eye while she give you head. Yo, do. oh uh uh-uh. uh. Okay. Thank you. Your name Blink, is Blink, bitch. Hi, my name Mm-mm. is Darian, and I'm 26. Okay. Okay, Darian, what do you do? I'm a social media manager. Okay. Very nice. And where do you see yourself in two years? So two years, I hope to further my career. I hope to work in something maybe a little bit more corporate. Um, but also, I'm letting God take the lead on that as well. Oh Lord. And you I brought hope Jesus to be married it. in two years. So you brought and Jesus into it. I hope it. to be a homeowner as well. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Your name and age. Hi, I'm Deja Marie. I'm 33. Um, Deja Marie, what do you do? I'm a finance manager. Okay. okay. And to answer this question, what, where do you see yourself in two years? Um, I would see myself continuing to grow professionally. I've been working my way through a variety of um, positions within the financial industry. Um, so I see myself continuing to grow and advance there and hopefully be in a long-term committed relationship working towards marriage. Rare. All right, thank you. Let's get one more down over here. Keto. Okay, your name and age. So I'm Tanaya, I'm 27. Tanaya, what do you do? So right now I'm pursuing my master's in marriage and family therapy. Okay, and now where do you see yourself in two years? In two years, I see myself being a <coughs> um, a, mother, a wife, um, marriage. <coughs> okay, let's head on back. Let's head on back. So, I'm right marrying y'all in 20 years. A pick, because it is time that you're going to have to pop one of these ladies' balloons. So, let me give that over to you and just go ahead and pop one of them. Yep, got to pop one. I'm over here looking for stuff. Go ahead, pop one, nigga. Okay, why did we end up popping hers? Uh, I guess the other answers, they're kind of, I'm oh, sorry, the other answers, I'm kind of like, I guess in tune with them. Mm-hmm. Sorry. No, That's okay. not that one. And so why did you have your balloon unpopped for him? I just wanted to hear a little bit more about him. Um, so I was just going to uh, listen to him talk a little bit more and see what he's about. Thank you. Okay, let's go ahead and ask another question. Uh, I thought I had a cheetah mask. Come tricks. on, here, listen. Oh, like some of you think that's weird about you, but you know you do it kind of, you know, leave a little time, you know. Okay, let's start over here. What's one of your weird traits? Um, you know, I don't know. Over there looking through all my mask. Um. Shit mask. I guess it's kind of random, but I like to do like word search puzzles and stuff like that. Like Sudoku. Oh Lord, get your grandma ass. I guess it's weird, maybe. (laughs) No. (laughs) Okay, Okay, let's go over here. What's a weird trick? Who let the dogs out? I have to say, probably watching ASMR eating videos or like mukbangs, like seafood boils and stuff. (laughs) Okay. Okay. Good. I don't know what that is, but you look like, like, <laughs> it's like people eating. Yeah, people eating like seafood boils. Like you never seen them? No. Nah. Um, really? No, nah, I never seen. Really? Them. Oh, wow. <laughs> hey, it's weird, I guess. <laughs> okay, we got one more. I can tell that she has a great sense of humor, but she hasn't told me. A you joke got a bird. Yet. Want a career as a pet psychic? We're not the school for you. A pet psychic. All right, what's one of your weird traits? So a weird trait that I have, um, oh. you know, when you have a piece of gum, I split it in half because it's too much gum. So I take half of the gum and then I eat it and I save the other half for later. Well, okay. stick a gum? Yeah. You a half a gum? I don't know. That's weird to me. That's weird. Hey, that's your type right there. She tall. She right, let you tall. Thank you. Got dark skin. Okay. I got some beautiful LeBron well, since James. Since you asked that question, I know probably wondering, what's your weird trait? Uh, well, when I'm driving, I kind of have little stories in my head and I act it out while I'm driving. Okay. Yeah. I'll be laughing at myself and I'll okay. oh, sorry. So you be laughing while you're driving by yourself? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I that's like, a light skin one in the brown. <laughs> okay, well, after this round, top I'm going to go ahead and have you pop another balloon. But that little thing, you over there folding down, holding it up, oh, holding it down. Oh, no. Okay, why'd you end up popping hers? Uh, the dress kind of ugly too. They look shit tied no up to the side. Kinda over there. Okay. You got to go for the one in the brown because I know you don't want the little, little short okay. right. turtleneck so over there. Why your for him? Um, I mean, I heard that he lives in Houston. That's where I live. Um, so yeah, I just want to see him. Yeah. All right. 
Cool, thank you. Damn, okay, you can add your Okay, oh, uh, all right, why did we end up popping? You can't compete with that the, beside you. Um, the Flat answer out. you just gave just reminded me more of the like truck driving, which was the thing. You can't for compete me, with that beside you because you seem really nice. They hip nice. dress you got on, they um, working, but yeah, it just, you got a little like, you, okay, you, got a, you got a midget bill. You all right, though? You all right, so, somebody. Yeah, yeah. She look crazy, man. So, I don't care, man. She, like, she looked right in your eye. Yeah. Yeah, she, she made it to the end. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, nah. She seemed like, like a good lady, girl, you know. Yeah. She look. I don't Thank know, man. Thank you. Any she crazy, boy. You, you better not give yes. her none, boy. Do don't give her children? no D. No. No kids. Okay. Do you have any passions besides video games or hobbies that you do uh, besides video games or truck driving? I mean, the only passion I have is I want to get a lake house. It'll be a you know nice little minute from now and yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. How do you feel about cats? <sighs> yeah. I don't think my dog might like a cat. Okay. So is that like a deal breaker for you? Uh, not really. Not really. I'll make a make a like a an exception to make arrangements. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> cuz I have a cat and she's not going anywhere. <laughs> I have a dog and he's rocking with me. Okay. Okay. Let me bring you on up here. Come on up. Come okay. on up. Okay. All right. So, I have a final question if there's no others. Okay. No? Uh, I do actually. Okay. So I'm trying to get out of it. About the lake house. I understand that you probably want to own a property that's the lake house. Is it just like you want to live there or are you trying to make something from it? Or like what do you some naive water. Firstly, are you naive? Religious or are you do you yeah. believe in God? I ain't yeah. A, ain't it yeah. So spelled what backwards. do you think Nivea. what else do you Don't think mess God has called you with to my do? Man. Like is the lake house something that you're doing a business with, or do you plan to do truck driving? Forever. Don't lose out on this baddie. Because I understand it's hard for a relationship. Mm -hmm. So once I kind of start to get full head nasty. Moving, I'm going to try to stay more local and kind of, you know, be there. And the lake house is uh, one time I was with my friend at the lake house and I just seen it. And I, I kind of dreamed like having a family there, having kids come over, mm -hmm. you know, having my like grandson, like, you know, sneak girls over, you know. We go drive on the boat and take them tubing. And That's all what's that. up, man. Hey, That's hey. What hey. Okay. Okay. So, <laughs> is it gonna be a yes for you for him? Yes. I'll try oh. It. Is it a yes for you for her? Sure. We got a show. This nigga get the baddie. <laughs> All right, I'll take this mic and you guys. That's what's up. up. <laughs> oh, okay. let's give it up for them guys. <laughs> hey, y'all missing out? Y'all pop y'all balloons? This nigga this trying to get a house with a the lake of a fighter. He a trying to have grandkids. I mean, he trying to have a family and some stability. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. Big shout out to them. One match already. We'll see the next one. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. What's your name? Hello, my name is Pointer. <coughs> Pointer, how old are you? I'm 30. <coughs> what are you? I am a talk show host and an educator. Okay. This kid, cool. Peel. Uh, what are some things like to do? This for King and Michael Key. I love to do the three E's. I like to eat. I like to exercise and I like entertainment. I like to be entertained. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so what are some things you look for in a woman? What I'm looking for in a woman, most importantly, uh, you have to love Jesus. Oh, I love Lord. Jesus. Um, and I also want a woman that's romantic. You know, um, I believe it was the prolific artist Mario that said, you should let me love you. Let me be the one to give you everything you want and need. Ah. Y'all know that. Okay, I'm, okay, yeah. But Mario. This nigga just hit the high note. a romantic woman. Someone that lets me love them. Okay. Uh, what are some of your deal breakers? Deal breakers. Um, poor communication. You know, I really want an effective communicator. Someone, if you're tripping, hair, there's a problem, let me know. Take you know, that take wig off, man. And um, you really sound like Brian Gumble. Music, like excessive. I'm more Motown. I'm more old school. Look, look, look. I'm more Motown. You know, so I like the older music. Okay. So that's, that's kind of my thing. Okay, got it. Yeah. All right, so we did get a few pop balloons. Right. Let's go on over there see why they ended up All popping. Right. All right. <laughs> okay, let's start with your name and age. I'm Jojo and I'm 30. Hello, Jojo. Oh, okay. Jojo, why'd you pop your balloon? Uh, at first, it was it was the look, it was the hair. Uh, <laughs> but you're it's a character. It's fun. But um, it's me. And then the, him. the ratchet music. Like I listen to Motown and everything too. But I, I, I gotta have a little bit of everything. Okay. okay. So you gonna you gonna miss the I streets? I just meant I guess someone exclusive, just mm. only only okay. ski -y. You know, that's just a little too much. Like you said, like, like give me grass some, but if you have the variation. That's that's great. You know. <laughs> now is Jojo someone that's your type? Yeah, she's a baddie. She's a baddie. She knows she's a tip. Yeah. 
She's a baddie with her baddie friend. Okay, never oh mind. My yeah. God. So I was trying to give you that ratchet. I was trying to give you that. You I appreciate know. that. Cause they look, boy, this nigga corny as hell. Look, 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 oh, yeah. boy, I tell you. Man, see, you, you see? <laughs> You're naming AIDS? You from the corner this way up out of here. I thought it was relevant. Didn't y'all think it was? Okay. <laughs> my name is Shayna and I'm 30. Awesome. Okay, I love that you love the Lord. Yes. But honestly, you are way too funny for me. I thought, don't y'all like a sense of humor? Like, it's, it's too much. Like, too it's much. way too much. Okay. <laughs> you seem you like a nice guy. I, it's just too much for me. I understand. Thank you, <laughs> Shayna. No problem. You know. Now, is Shayna someone that's your type? Oh, absolutely. Yes. I love the purple. Purple Rain. I'm a Prince fan, so it's looking good. Purple, purple Rain. I'm a Prince fan. Thank you. Let's go on over here. <clears throat> your name and age? I'm Deja Marie. I'm 33. Awesome. Marie, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, when you came out, it almost seemed like you were in costume, and I didn't like the hair piece or like the toupee or what that is. Um, but you speak very well, and you have a very nice smile. I love your teeth. Oh. Um, it's very welcoming. Um, so wow. you have a beautiful smile. So it was just the hair. Was it, it was just the. It just seemed like you were in maybe costume or something. I, I don't see that you would go out and dress like that or maybe have I'm, that. I'm gonna switch it up for you. I can, I can vary. It, is it a hair piece? It, uh, it, it, it identifies as a part of me, but I switch it up just like a lot of my beautiful <laughs> queens. We all go from one hairstyle. Hey, to the next hey, one. hey, So I like okay. to switch it up. Okay. I, I just didn't know if there. it was you like your everyday down. look or if you were coming out to no, be I'll funny. No, I'll switch it up for you. I just Brex. Oh, I, I, did, I didn't like Brex. Brex. Dave Marie, I would switch it up if you need me to switch it up. He's a good if host. Locked in, there is Wherever he hosts that he good I at. I like that. Okay. He's very... Okay. Okay. But that was all. Okay, okay. Now she's Dave the one that's your type. I'm, I'm going to say yes. Dave Marie, I'm uh, switching She's thicker than a snicker, so I think that's always a great thing. This dude funny as Thank you. Yes, thank you, Deja. Thank you. All right, your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Misha and I'm 27. Um, the reason that I popped my balloon, um, I just kind of felt like it wasn't serious when you came out. Come on, Auntie. Felt like a, like she said, kind of like a. Well, somebody said they below. Like she tried to get up, man. Something. Don't I tell me she the thirsty Thundercat of the season. Seemed like a really nice man though, but I was just really trying to see the real you, and I don't feel like I'm getting the real you right now. Why not? Okay. This okay. is where he presented okay. himself. This it's is real, you though. I'm real. I'm real. That's what I'm saying. You know, this I'm a talk show might be real. Host. I educate. Love the kids. Uh, love the kids. Know. It's a good thing. Yeah. Trick love the kids. Come on, I man. I would love to see the real one, though. <laughs> this is so, probably okay. him. You no, probably just don't have the hairpiece on. I love her height. Yes. Mm -hmm. so I'm, 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 taller is better. Normally, uh, taller children would mm -hmm. be produced. So, yeah, that would, that would be be great. Yeah. I love right. the height. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> Competing with each other comes naturally. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Miriam. I'm 34. Um, it's Joy first, Taylor. It was the overall look. Um, it was just too cheesy for me. And then, you know, as I kind of listened to him, I know he said big on, you know, religion. Joy Taylor. I'm a Christian. Jesus. I'm a Muslim, and I'm big on religion as well. Okay. And I just felt like that would be a clash. And mm. you're funny, you know, and I like somebody who makes me laugh, but more like a that's my homeboy, my little brother, cousin, mm. you know, like. Yeah, dating wise, no. Yeah, okay. Can. Yeah. I understand. All right. Is uh, Miriam someone that's your type? Yes, you know, Allahu Akbar. I uh, definitely appreciate my Muslim sisters. This nigga um, dub, man. Yes. What country? Uh, Somalia. I'm from oh, Somalia. Oh, oh. You from yeah. Somalia. Wonderful. I you from Augusta. You from them. Yeah. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's going over here. Your name and age and why you ended up mm -hmm. popping your balloon. But I'm there, uh, 27, and. Um, I can't take you home to my parents. I can't. What would the parents say? What? What's, no. I'm a good, classy Poor man. Family. Right. The they whole family. A clown. Uh, you call this man a clown? I don't. Do I look they like Ronald? Do I look like Not Ronald? You were oh, clown. oh, they, they were clown. clown. I was, I was gonna oh, respect sorry. whatever you say. Okay. No. Why, why would they clown me? You're not my type. Oh, okay. No. Okay. Okay. I think it, it, they think I'd probably be joking taking you there. Mm. Yikes. <laughs> this okay. is his man. This is his style. Low, yeah, low this key. Is, this is him. Uh, but but still key, but low key. Oh. Like on the piano, we going from maybe Why like a G to an A. Um, I mean, not really. Maybe the, me and her maybe have similar hair kind of situations going oh, no. on. So I kind of not a wig. Oh no no I've just no well this isn't really either. But I like I like the, yours. you're still I, still key. I'm still feeling you. I'm still feeling. You. But you know B. That ain't natural. That ain't not. It, it might not be a wig, but it ain't <laughs> real. <laughs> Your name and age and why you ended up. Don't do my mans in them like Hi, that. I'm Tanaya. I'm 27. Uh, um, I just 
can't get with oh, the last the pop. overall appearance and oh, I just wouldn't take you serious and okay. I need someone that's serious. I like to have fun but mm. and be goofy, but I think it's a little too much for me. A little too much. Yeah. Yeah. You think he care? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. It's Everybody for the look up this nigga show down. Stallion. Yes. Thank Stallion. You. Yeah. I bet he great at what he do. His hosting awesome. job, his duties. Thank you. He, 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 he elaborate and oh, enunciate girl, all his words correctly. Name it and why you end up popping at the end. My name I like is the dude funny to me. And, you know, I get it because I'm in entertainment too. But I just, I wanted to see you without the wig and the glasses. Well, these are prescription. I can't, I can't, decision. I wouldn't be able to see how beautiful you are without them. Right, bitch. No, I have prescription too. Like, yeah. I'm like, you ain't got them on. Tell them, bitch. I wear glasses. Um, Tell them. I don't have glasses. But I, I kind of figured you wouldn't want to take off your I mean, I don't, glasses but... and ruin the whole, like, look and this is the my brand. I do it to play around. I got all kind of glasses. But I wanted you to do that to get my final decision. Because, like, I get it. Like, I'm You didn't even give me, you didn't have to pop. You could have been like, yo, yo, handsome talk I knew show that man. you wouldn't do it. How did you know that about me? Because it's only been, entertainment business, only been seven. And you're not no. going to ruin your look. For how good you look, there's a possibility. <laughs> nah, that them boots she got on. Wow. She going to tell me my life. Her, her boots like a gondolier. No. What's them? Uh, and then I can. Well, get my well you, you already popped, so I'm kind of like, my, my emotions. I didn't mean to pop it. He did. Oh, you didn't mean to pop it? No. Nah, she she going to try to use you. I have arthritis. Before the hooker like, hands are bad. And like, uh -oh. it accidentally literally. He going to go somewhere. Just pop. You want the Everybody blueprint? need a good host. Uh, uh, if you're willing to take off your She kind of broke my heart. She kind of broke my heart. It was uh, If she hadn't have popped. I, I think you I would have. have. You sound serious. like that dude to be talking about all the not, stars and stuff. Neil deGrasse Tyson. Saying it's a character. It's like this, you know. When, this might when be my him. baddies have wigs and weaves, that's it's, well, sure it's accepted. Just, what are you talking about, man? The the glasses. You that's what they tell me. I would have switched it up. the glasses. I told you I would have switched it up. But okay, I ain't going to, you know. I'm a little hurt because you are gorgeous. I love the... You didn't ask if she's my type, Arlette. Come on, come on. Oh, because you, ah, that's my type. You, you didn't want her to get her balloon bag. It don't matter She has now. faith on her face. <laughs> okay, never mind. Okay. Right. Hey, man, All big right, shout out to him, man. You had fun. You came, you saw, you conquered, bro. Thank you. I was serious. Get your ass out of here. He was serious. Thank you, ladies. I'll take this mic. Thank you. Watch. They're going to see him on the gram without their wig on. He's probably rich. Y'all missed out on a good nigga. This is a little corny. It all started with one smart decision. Trust me, my wife okay, said the same thing about me. My wife said I'm corny. Guy. I'm a nerd. I'm a lame. I'm an L7. Hello, I'm a thug. In. What's your name? Uh, my name's uh, James Moore. James, what do you do? James Moore. Uh, I work in Salt Lake City right now. Okay, and how old are you? 35. I've been everywhere, nice. man. Uh, what are some I'm, things I'm, like some stamps, passports. Uh, hang this? out with friends. Uh, Whack, like I am into Prescott. Gaming, so okay. a little bit of that. Uh, I do wake Music, music. The boys production. got the whole stunned already. Uh, there ain't nobody stopped yet. Spontaneous. So, uh, lately this year I went um, lately, to Thailand for two months. Mm. Uh, to Thailand, he travels. Yeah. So I'm pretty open to like doing fun stuff, open, but just you gotta work on my boys. Mm. Taking it easy. I okay. do like to work out a lot. Like so fitness out. is a thing. For me. <laughs> got it. Uh, what are some things to look for in a woman? <coughs> um, <coughs> I'm out of that. I don't work out. Ain't got the deep just voice. Chill, <laughs> down to earth, um, kind, nice, kind of a. I got just shirts like that. Though. I got some ugly shirts really around here, man. Really involved in what she um, wants to do for career-wise work. I got like, ugly you know, shirts. That's something she's passionate about. Mm -hmm. Let me see um, if I got as well. Shirt. I kind of find that that oh. kind of motivates me about the things that I'm passionate about as well. Okay. So, yeah. Off got the top it. of my head, I could think that's what it would be. Uh, and what are some deal breakers? <sighs> deal breakers. Um, <laughs> so, I would say kids. But the thing is, uh, I'm not against kids because I have homegirls and friends that have children. Um, yeah, home the thing is for me is that the girl that I get together with, um, I want to have a family with. So I kind of want to start from the beginning. So that's probably uh, the reason why I would mention that. Okay. And then someone that's kind of just honestly like not not uh, kind, mm. I think is kind of the things I could really mention. So, okay. Yeah. All so. right. So we did get a pop down there. Let's go on over pop, there and there see why pops. they ended up popping. All right. We can have your name and age. Hi, I'm Zola Stone. I'm 31. Look at this shirt. This I'm Zola Stone. Why did you end up popping your shirt? I got to earn this shirt. Um, I feel like we have a lot in common. You know, I do music as well. I'm a recording artist. I like the shirt. But I feel like you probably want a girl that's more, like, clean. She looked like that chick so that, that um, 
And I'm just Zion country. Williams got pregnant. <laughs> Mariah May, she's like the skinny Mariah yeah, May. The Them boots are nasty. Look. They look I'm like they look like just, bullets just all over there, man. <laughs> kind of what i like just just saying i don't know i just kind of figured where everybody oh, probably not gonna like the face Look, somebody pops it. So that's kind of you kind of what i like they're you like know. bitch I'm like, you, like, I you think that he's just so like clean like perfect i, I have tattoos <laughs> like, as well very maybe too strict i don't know I oh, might the be boots too nasty uh <laughs> like i'm sorry i don't know that's the vibe i get like he yeah he clean cut he clean. Oh, working man that's a great dude man and, um, they have some I'm great bachelors up here these women missing out on dancer, <clears throat> they're trying so. to be in the club oh, and stay in the like streets that. and have oh, a God. certain aesthetic I on that. I get that. yeah like i don't know <laughs> this is okay. this, this, this kind of lame yeah, the little taco the meat with the little chain and i'm super creative but it might right. be too wild. <laughs> but he okay. clean. Okay. Got all his so damn teeth and he got a like job. All that. So is she That's what grandma used to look for back in the uh, day. Got a job, got all his teeth. cool, the last part. Ain't no yeah, weirdo. Yeah, I think I'm cool. I'm good on that. I'm good on that. No judgment, though. But Right, right. Look at Mariah May. That, she got Thank faith you. on her face. She <laughs> like, look. <laughs> she got, she got, look, look, they popping. They're like, you talking to her? Brante, 27. Brante. What would you end up popping your balloon? Cause my I dress. Have a beautiful sun. So, no, thank you. She had a cute okay. face though. I can't front on that. No, she's someone that's your type. Yeah, she definitely would be my type. She's a uh, very she attractive. Yeah. yeah I like I like the color of the dress and everything. Very, yeah, it's just. Yeah, my son the is dress, to me. That little dress like a look, um, look twenty thirteen, look okay. twenty twelve. Yeah. Um, single mom so you know i don't deal with no drama or nothing it's just me it, it ain't so, fitting right it is you know she kind of uh, box like she got like a track star so if somebody doesn't like she's a run him, track or something. Get me. so yeah i totally understand she's straight though thank you, you know? she's straight ain't nothing against her just the longer we look at them, I get to dissect them a little more. Let's head on back. We did get a pop right on over here. Your you know, name and age. That's what I'm doing. My I'm name is Misha, and I'm 27. Ain't hey, T. Misha, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I just physically wasn't attracted. Um, you are a good-looking man. No she she, she got pretty eyes. Just, she I look better. I'm saying the longer you look at these people, the, the better see, they look. Um, myself. First, you know, first instinct is different. Um, a little too short for you. No, it's not even the shortness. Like, it, yeah, I don't think you're short though. So. Yeah, sure, you regular height. Heels right now. About six foot. But um, five, just 11, like you know, your outfit and stuff, it just wasn't my vibe. So okay. That's it. okay. Mm -hmm. Her dress is um. No, she's someone that's Scooby Doo. Uh, it's she, our, she, I think she, it's she, shaggy. But probably not someone I would really go for. Yeah, honestly. baby hairs. Why not? Um, I'm tired of the baby hairs. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Just, just not my type, yeah. It's not my yeah, type, man. It's not my type, yeah. yeah. Pinpoint it. I can't I pinpoint it. I can't pinpoint it. Okay. All right. I guess we'll let it slide. <laughs> yeah, let, let it slide. Let it slide. Let's go. Okay. Your name and age. I'm Shayna, and I'm 30. Okay. And Shayna, oh, no. Look at Shayna's shoes. Let's see. So okay. you are very handsome. Very? But physically, just not my type. And the outfit, too. Yeah, the outfit disgusting. Yeah, what, what are you into physically? I want to know. I don't know. I don't see myself with you. Like... When I saw you, there wasn't like no kind of connection. Yeah. Um, but you are good looking, like. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. He's trying Appreciate to figure it. out is it something specific? Yeah, I want to know like what what right. kind of men are you mm -hmm. into? Like what, what what turns you on? What gets you excited? Why it ain't you, nigga? So why you care about her? Just when I saw you, I didn't feel any kind of connection. Okay. Um, but you are good looking, so. All right. Thank you. Well, right, at least we'll she it, ain't we'll shallow. Yeah. Well, yeah, see, we'll we let, let you slide once. Yeah. That's one slide. <laughs> Your name and age. I'm Jojo and I'm 30. Okay. And Jojo, why did you pop your balloon? Uh, the attraction just wasn't there. I like that you're into fitness because uh, I am too. But um, as I was just looking, I was like, no, the, yeah. just the attraction. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I'll tell you. Don't no, she's someone that's your type. Uh, really. yeah. She, she yeah. looks mean, I, yo. Your eyes are very beautiful. Thank she you. Yeah, she do like have pretty eyes. Well that's what I'm saying. And the, the dress. So, yeah, probably would be someone I would, nah, that dress. I would uh, choose. Mm -hmm. yeah. cool. would like to what are them clear jellies? She got just off appearance. That yeah, I probably would choose her. Yeah. Thank you. I don't like how her look. Okay, neck. so we do still have three balloons left unpopped. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these ladies a question. Just they're trying to get somebody. They're trying to who's more of your type. Hmm. All right. Um, they look very. What do you each feel others. like has been a very positive attribute, and the men that you've dated that has been kind of like something that's been brought up over time? Okay, let's start over here. Your name and age, and the answer to his question. Hi, I'm Deja Marie. I'm 33. 
And do you mean a positive attribute within myself or within the partners I typically choose? Yeah, your personality. My personality. Um, I would say I'm very understanding. I'm very caring. Um, I'm very loyal and supportive. Um, I have a good ear to listen, and um, I care about my partner's emotional well-being. So that's always been a positive in my past relationships. I like that. I like that. Mm. Let's go over here. Name, age, and the answer to this question. Yeah, big ass. My name is there. Miriam. I'm 34. What was the question again? Because I didn't. You hear like it. you 43. Like you lying about your so age. So basically, like, what's like a positive attribute of um Miriam. that you've had people tell you uh, from like the people that, that you, you didn't ran through um, consistently, like about you that they've lied on the low. You know, no like, disrespect. You like you didn't had a few. Um, I pour into the person I'm dating. Um. Oh, you got baby daddy like drama. Got, will, she ain't got so no kids. I'm surprised. Those childbearing hips. Um, I'm nice. <laughs> I, I mean, I really don't know. I feel like they really don't that say it. She might be the hood. She's kind of like the um, hood. It's never like, I don't know, man. Like oh, she, well, you do this and you do that. And I she like probably this, take I like care of the shit. She might be a good one. Yeah, I got you. I'm 50 on her. And then we got one more. She might walk around the house cooking and cleaning all day. Hi, I'm Tanaya. I'm 27. Um, I would say a positive attribute from past partners is that I'm well, look, naturally genuine. Um, why she sticking her stomach out like that? You don't need um, to put. You don't need to accentuate your stomach. Um, if you go to listen to if you, your shit, look like that. Um, it's like you poke. But um, it's like you pregnant. You could yeah, and then I always bit. smile. And you got to find shit that's fitting really to positive you. Positive attribute that my partners, that, that look crazy. partners would say. I always smile. Just because it look, I mean, it might look better in That's a cool. different outfit. Right. You know what I'm saying? You know, but they had them strings and okay. lines going across there. So head. I am going to hand you a pen. So you know, they're looking like you a dope boy. to pop one of these ladies' balloons, just based off of what you've heard, what you've seen, all that good right, stuff. You got a long ass foot, over. too, cheetah dress. There you go. And then just go ahead and pop one of theirs. Yeah, I guess it's, it's a lot of foot on that shoe. Water's coming to the glass. Water's coming. What is this? Some Lord of the Rings. Okay. This is horrible. <laughs> That's what they're trying to get. They're trying to get them a ring too. One ring to rule them all. Don't take offense. Don't take offense. Don't take offense. Uh, okay. Uh. Why did we end up popping hers? She we seems like you. a really nice person, mm -hmm. but just, just not my speed. Yeah. She advanced. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We'll tell you, baby. Now you did have your balloon unpopped for him. Why so? Um, I just wanted to hear more, like. Physically, I wasn't attractive, but I'm learning to not look at the physical. So I just yeah, wanted to kind of hear more. But we didn't match, so it's okay. <laughs> I'd have been like, come on, man. <laughs> I'm handsome. You can't tell me okay, I ain't handsome. Let's I'm back. I, if it was me, okay, I don't know about him. I don't know if he had the confidence here. to say I'm that. I'm going to ask the ladies a question, and then I'll you know, have she, she, a question. She, she had a big old ass. She been ran through you. Um, I don't care nobody say question i'm gonna think about it. give me a second okay well, not even that stay red through right. to say okay ladies any questions she got a, a, a abundance of bodies down there? okay let's start down here just because she's been looking like that for a long time so what are your long-term goals like with the next couple of years and the light skin oh, uh, she, she might have preserved her um, shit. maybe continue working uh investing kind of like really setting money this aside. right here and the long run i want to like live abroad so that's like some african possibly shit. buy properties in that. asia that little Mexico, gold thing going um, across the invest in businesses mm -hmm. I kind of want to open like a laundromat up. I'm kind of really wanting to just kind of get up like residual income. Right, um, right. That sort of thing, really. That's kind of like in the forefront. And of course, meet okay. someone that I could kind of establish a relationship with and uh, start a family. Yeah. Okay. What would that look like in in the midst of all that? Because that seems like that's a lot for. No, bitch. I don't think it's too much. I think you're going to work ain't. and just, you know, money comes in time. So you can mm. allocate finances and just do what you need to do. You, 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 you talk to the wrong one. Kind of build upon that and get to know them and you know, allocating the residual direction. income you, you know, say that hopefully they're both you both are on the same page so i know alopecia yeah. this is what oh, you I rub see. on you okay. yeah. that's my question all right <laughs> okay any questions over here um yes well, aloe vera are i you, said alopecia how do you that's feel about you long distance relationships or where are you alopecia where you aloe vera i stay in la right now los angeles uh I've never done a long distance relationship, so I'm 50 50 about it. I don't know if I can give a yes or no, but I feel like if it's the right person, I think that, yeah, it's probably worthwhile. Yeah. And where are you? I know you say he's LA. I'm in Wisconsin. Oh, Lord. So we would be quite away. I've, yeah. I've never been to Wisconsin. Actually, I think I have been once to like a Wendy's or something like that. <laughs> I was like 15. 
<laughs> but I haven't really been in Wisconsin. That's why she's so light bright. I've never been to LA either, so. Oh, you gotta, you gotta come to LA. She ain't got no sun. Hey. <laughs> All right. So, if you're ready to pop, you can pop. Or if you have another question, you can ask the ladies another question. Um, what do you ladies look for in a guy? Like, what, what are you looking for? What's oh, come the situation? on. Okay. I'm looking for someone that's um, ready to be committed in a committed relationship. I don't want to waste time anymore. I'm 33, so I don't want to want interact to. with situationships that are just going to pass the time. I she want something like more long term where I can get to know someone on a deeper level um, um, and really build that friendship. The more really and more she talks, I can hear you know a marriage or starting our own oh, family. No man. Um, I just don't want to deal with anyone if they're just to pass the time. And I would hope she someone a whole is bunch of nasally whiny commit in that way as well. Sound or at like least the nanny. work towards that type of commitment. Okay. She sounds like she's from Wisconsin. Here. She sounds like she's northern. She sounds like she's from up there. So I'm looking on. for someone that I can Close to Canada, with. somebody. Um, someone that I can call my best friend, but also my lover. Who's my um, best friend? Also, someone that is committed and that wants a family and wants marriage because family is everything to me. So I want somebody that's pick somebody, man. This is getting boring. And grounded in faith. It doesn't have to be a certain denomination, but have to believe in something. Sounds good. It's time to pop. Got to pop one of their balloons. The one in the pink, she had a real cute face. If you really look at it, it's hard. I know, I know. They're amazing ladies. <laughs> she remind me of the girl off um, my two picks. Foolish. Oh, all right. Okay, um, you call that movie yeah, Foolish with Master P and Eddie Griffin. Your foolish girlfriend. Can't oh, make a decision. Baby mom. Yes, you can. No, 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 you I ever can. see that movie? No, I can't. One in the pink, that's um, a, a dance, a singer or something. R&B. What she look like? Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. All right. We tried to do something cool. What was that? So you about to hurt people? Like, hers. I saw it was really, it's really, really tough. So what made you decide? Honestly, it was really, really tough. I, I think you both are great. I think all the ladies are actually pretty great. Um, I wish I could have a little more time to get to know you. Just body, um, no. body, yada, 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 yada. Your response on the last question I felt was kind of rushed, and I, I get what you were saying. Mm -hmm. um, caught, that voice like caught up with you. So she sounded like a mosquito. Yeah, I felt she was a little more calm and madder about it. You mean like rushing to a relationship or rushing what regard? Just the energy. Like, I get what you were saying, but look I felt it. like it was real kind of like, her. just uh, like, look at like, She's stern. Like, look at she's looking at him now. now. Okay. She's trying to figure out. <laughs> stern like, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Let's come on up here. Come on up. Come on up. Uh, look at her. All right. So, look I have a final there. question. If you guys are all good. Oh, yeah. Y'all from them. No. Oh, no way. No, you can go. You can go. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so <laughs> is it gonna be a yes for you for him? Yes. Oh, is it a yes for you for her? Yeah. We got a man. Yeah, she look better. It look okay. better when it's from a distance, like that. when you sit up there, man. And you guys can go on off. Okay, okay. another match. Yes, oh, gonna, give it yeah. up for them. Oh. Oh yeah, you guys. Uh, you y'all gonna have them Godzilla baby. <laughs> <laughs> Who are these people? New mustard. Old spicy order. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. I will see. Hello, welcome. What's your name? Hi, uh, my name is Jeremy. Jeremy, how old are you? I'm 34. And what do you do? What is that in the back I'm of your head? I'm an operations manager for a global logistics company. Okay, very cool. What are some things like to do for fun? You're a global uh, I'm a musician. I'm a writer, a songwriter, okay. a poet, author, and coach. Very nice. Uh, now, what are some things you look for in a woman? Um, honest women. Okay. What is that one, thing in the back uh, of his head is sticking up? Mm -hmm. um, you ain't got no hang time. A relationship uh, with her spiritual father. Okay. Um, and my interpretation of that is God. Um, a woman that knows what she wants and that's focused on her goals. Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, deal breakers are lack of accountability. Mm -hmm. Well, look. Um, are African? What is this? Uh, is this JJ from Good Times? Men well. So okay. if you have like dad issues oh, or you got a reckless mouth, it's probably not gonna work. Okay. Uh, reckless uh, mouth. I hate to say this, but like the last one, I hate to have to say this is hygiene. Hygiene, okay. Yeah. What's your preference? Right, <laughs> shit, ain't no wrong with that. All right, so What's we have head? no pop balloons. 
So you're doing well. <laughs> so what that means, I'm going to actually go ahead and switch it on over to you. Okay. Um, so for the first round, I am going to have you pop two. two balloons based off of what you're seeing so far. Who doesn't really fall into your type? Whatever it may be. So let me hand you a pick. Can I ask a question or do I have to nah, Not this round. Next round. <laughs> and pop two. It's tough. I know. Um, <laughs> green. Okay, and one more. Green. No, no, white. White. No, 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 no. All right. I don't want none of them. Let's start with the first the one. African. Pop in. Okay, the African. So you have your name and age. My name is Miriam, and I'm 34. And Miriam, why did you have your balloon unpopped? You popped yours first. I don't know, honestly. Okay. <laughs> I think I was zoned out. Oh. I don't know. Oh, I mean. No, seriously. Um, I think I just wanted to hear more, but I, I also couldn't hear him as much. Mm. But yeah, I just wanted to hear more. Okay, so is he someone that is your type? No. Okay, yeah. what makes him not your type? Um, he's too slim, and just. Then why did you pop off hair, gay? Um, I just don't feel like braids is like something for an older guy in his thirties. Just, I mean, just my yeah. opinion. And um, when you first came out, I, I'm a appearance person. Um, I think it was like your bottom teeth, and I'm just oh. on teeth as well. <laughs> So, I mean, that really was just it. Yeah. All right. So, as uh, Miriam's, I know you end up popping her balloon. Why'd you end up popping hers? <laughs> um, get her back. Get her really back. my type. Okay. Yeah, you ain't my type. Uh, it seems. Get her. Get her. I mean, you're 34. I didn't, I didn't see that, but uh, I thought she was a little bit older. Yeah. Oh. That's kind of why I popped. But. Okay. Right. Get the old face. Thank you. And then you did pop <laughs> one more. Let's go over here. Your name and age. My Marie, 33. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you have your balloon unpopped? Um, I just wanted to hear you talk a little bit more to see what you were about. So is he someone that's your type? Uh, typically not. Um, but I was but you didn't still pop. wanting to know a little bit more. So you I'm gonna ask, you're what makes him not really wanna... your typical type? <laughs> um, I would say uh, the build. Um, I like a little bit more stocky, more um, like athletic. Get on that full here. Um, and rough. then uh, you have a very i love your height though i love tall guys so i love your height that's a plus um but typically i just like a little bit more um build and then uh the hair uh, get her back 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 all right so why did we end up, up shoot them out, shoot them out. Shoot um, come on get her back kind of similar answer to you gave you're just not not using my type like i mean you're beautiful though thank like, you yeah, no she is she is about that you just not usually what I go for. Oh, she beautiful. And I don't know if that's you know. good or bad because it's where people throw out frivolously. <laughs> it's beautiful. All right, thank she you. Aye. She's straight for okay, the stroke. Okay, so for the next round, you can go ahead and ask a question now. Cool. Cool. Um, cool. Come on, Joe L and B face. <laughs> it like um Do any of you have children? What's this? Okay. What's I think we have one down. DeAndre there. Ayton. Okay. Let's see what he look like. Or How many he children? had a big face oh, like that. Let's go down there. Okay, let's start with your name and age. Briante, 27. Okay, and then the thing he wanted to know, how many kids do you have? One. You just said one. Yeah. Okay. I was asking because that's kind of my limit. Like. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate just the one. honesty. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. So it's not a yeah. No, no, it's not Part a Part of a judging people. It's my, one. It's my limit. So <laughs> yeah, I appreciate right. it. Put it back. <laughs> yeah, I'm very judgy. Oh, come on, even can put a damn ad right now. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, so we only have one that has a child. Any other questions? Get on his boots. Um, yeah, why are you single? Hmm. Oh, okay, we'll still ask, and then we'll go. Okay. All right. All Ooh, right. everybody popping. Why is that a popping question? <laughs> you know, it's the truth. <laughs> let's, let's start here then. Your name and age, and why are you single? My name is Misha, and I'm 27. Um, the reason that I'm single is because I have done a really good job of figuring out what I like. And I feel like I'm at the age right now where I can date and I do know what I want. Um, I think my earlier years, I was having fun, figuring out everything. And now it's like kind of all keen in, I'm focused. I know what I dress want. They're nasty. I don't care. You have one more unpopped. <laughs> and uh, why are you single? I think I'm single because <laughs> Um, I tend to pick the wrong men. Um, I do go for more of bad boys and um, 
everything you're not probably supposed to go for, but uh, I like to take our little risk. She but, need a financial backer. She need a backer yeah, man. I think I'm going to go out of my element right. now. <laughs> so we did get a few pops when you asked, why are you single? Let's start right here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, I'm Zola Stone. I'm 31. And I popped just because, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm single because just being in the entertainment industry is it's just tough. You know, I'm a recording artist, and then I'm an exotic dancer on the side. On the side. Um, That's your main job, thing. bitch. Kind of too old. My body hurts at this point. So <laughs> it's it's not a every day. It's more the music side is every day. You can you pay know? more for but, dancing than the damn... Music. You probably won't like that, so. Okay. So you popped because you think he wouldn't like it. it? Just, it just like reminded me like, just dating in the industry is so tough. I don't know. So is she someone that is your type though? Um, not them boots. Probably not generally, but I did like your answer. So um, I appreciate your, like, authenticity. I've seen more about you than I did at that particular time. So, um, like, if we met, like, yeah, I would talk to her. Yeah, absolutely. And you're gorgeous, by the way, so. Thank you. No, you too. A handsome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, you're good, girl. You popped. You popped. You popped. You popped. All right. Name an age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hi, I'm Shana, and I'm 30. Um, you are handsome. You are definitely my type. I just did not like the question. I feel like when men ask that sometimes, they're trying to find something wrong. Um, nah, they want to know, bitch, why are you so I'm toxic? I'm because I'm single. I haven't met the person. I just didn't like the question. Nah, you, you My trying to ask that that is okay. I was more so asking to see if there was any accountability or self-evaluation Boom. that you were like willing to present in this conversation. Any vulnerability you was willing to give me you in see? this small space. This nigga thinking. Um, but I, I can see how that can become like our same aggressive and he does on these shit this time boy um, coming up here today we ain't seen no fuck in, nigga i've always taken the time to kind of step back and so see far. areas that i can improve um but it just didn't work out you know i just i just didn't like the question You're but smart, i do intelligent men you know, come up here today and very handsome so yeah thank you <laughs> I ain't really had, i'm telling you all right and now is she someone that's your type um yeah was like, it yeah, 19 um she has a great smile so seems it. like she's authentic and genuine it's one of my favorite numbers yeah Thank you. 19. Okay, name and age and why you ended up popping. I'm JoJo and I'm 30. But. Um, so I pop. I don't think it's a bad question, but dudes. I don't necessarily like the question either. Um, it definitely um, gave me like, to see like, is there something wrong hey, with me? Which is why I'm single. Uh, body, boy, I feel that, like that's leopard. kind of what most men get at because I have heard you that question before. Um, I don't think it was a bad question. It's just, yeah, it was that. Otherwise, okay. yeah. So is he someone that is your type apart from that question? I like his height and well, complexion. Wisconsin got looks. it over there. Yeah. She probably got a waist And now she's someone that's your type. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's beautiful. Your eyes, complexion. Yeah. Thank you. Very you very don't want no hair from her. I'm yeah. telling you, she got too much forehead. Thank you. Thank you. My guy. Okay, so we do have two beautiful ladies left. Any other questions you want to ask them? GMC Sierra. Oh, my God. It's the truck. Or it's get 6,000 you want, you want um, get a GMC. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you had an unlimited bank account, uh, somebody wrote you a blank check to do whatever you wanted to do with it, what would you do? Mm -hmm. Start over here. <laughs> um, I would probably, I, because I played sports, um, volleyball, so I would probably do a nonprofit for um, you know, kids who don't have the ability to get to college and stuff and kind of create something so they can have the ability to go to college, get the right funding, get nah. the right, you know, um, mentorship. The state or whatever. Like Somebody gonna take that. Um, so that's what I would do. Do that shit ground level, yo. Really big with kids. So go to the hood and pass that shit out. Let's go on over like here. A, like a rapper. Okay, if you wanna go ahead and answer his question. Right, niggas need that um I would see, say see first bums, off, see everybody. I would take them off my family. Just, Get that shit away. And um, start a business, of course. And On top of take care of your own shit. But we're with I'm, my family I'm, as well. And significant other, of course. Um, yeah, I kind of like keep the generational generational like foundation going. So. Damn right. Start mm -hmm. some businesses. Mm -hmm. Do some shit. All right. Get Ladies, any questions for him? Do 
you have oh, hold on. sorry. <laughs> do you have children? I do not. Okay. I do not. Right. That was uh, okay. Any questions over here? Do you like to have fun? Like, are you spontaneous? Absolutely. Do you like to go outside? Oh, she's trying to win. Oh, night I'm or something like. Win. I love long walks on the beach. I don't think I can I listen to you. Absolutely. <laughs> okay, so is it going to be a yes for you for him? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and is it a yes for you for her? Absolutely. We got a man. She got to look like a man. That, um, I'll take this. Y'all going off. Yeah. She's trying to win a show. That's crazy. She knows getting down to the end. She's trying to win. All right, like let's her. go ahead and bring out our next single guy. This is getting boring. I ain't gonna lie. Hello, welcome in. Let's see. Oh, Lord. What's your name? Hi. Oh, Lord. Uh, my name is Jeremiah. Jeremiah, how yes. old are you? I'm 34 years old. Okay, and what do you do? <laughs> 34 I work in telecom, and I'm a real estate agent. Okay. Now, what are Fat some things you like to do for fun? Yes. Yeah, so I like to travel. I like to travel to Mexico, primarily, and uh, I would love to find someone to take with me. Okay. Is this thing a robot? What is he? Now, what are some things you look for in a woman? So, uh, so like some of my deal breakers. Oh, no. What, what do you look for in a woman? Are you so, mm-hmm. so, is he a sports that caster? Very feminine, someone that is beautiful, of course. And You're not manly, though. I love mm. to eat. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> do you oh, think you're kind of weird? Of course. Okay. Of course. Okay. <laughs> now, like a robot, yo. This thing's AI. Deal breakers, mm-hmm. So, uh, cigarette smoking. Okay. Uh, someone that may have uh, a kid. Okay. And, uh, that's pretty much it. So, yeah. yeah. Cigarettes right. and children. So we did get a few pop balloons. <laughs> okay. What's going pop on with this? Like, what what popping. Okay. No, I ain't walking. He's sashaying. Hi, I'm Deja Marie. I'm 33. Hi, Deja. Hi. Deja, why'd you pop? Uh, the reason I popped, it was just initial attraction. Um, it wasn't there for me. And I do typically like uh, taller men. Um, but you have very, very beautiful, striking eyes. You have a nice smile. Thank so you. outside of that, that was pretty much all. Thank you. Now, is uh, Deja Marie someone that's your type? Uh, not initially. However, uh, past the initial look, I could possibly love her personality. Okay. Yeah. So you said not initially. Is there the something person, specific? Or? Uh, just the way that uh, I, I usually like a little bit darker women, oh. if that makes sense. My black queens. <laughs> I understand. All right. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Let's go on over here. Okay. Your <laughs> name and age. My name is Misha, and I'm 27. Um, the reason why I popped... Um, I personally like darker skin, men, okay. so, it, um, but you beautiful. I mean, eyes are amazing. You look yeah, amazing. It's like they white girls. I don't know. Thank you, Misha. I appreciate show. that. Now, is uh, Misha someone that's your type? Yes, okay. for sure. 100%. <laughs> yes, for sure. Right, 100%. Perfect. Thank you. Let's go over here. Okay. This nigga look You're crazy. Like this. My name is Miriam. I'm 34. And Miriam, why did you pop your balloon? Um, it's just the height, honestly. Okay. Not the height. You're very handsome, but you, you have beautiful eyes. But just, just the height. Okay. I appreciate like that. Him. Thank he, you. He looks, he looks taller than you. Yeah. <laughs> taller than me is about six, uh, you know, uh-huh. like six four. Oh, so you wanna, you, know? you wanna climb a tree? Yeah. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> okay. I got, it. I got, I got you. I got you. <laughs> all right. Now is Miriam someone that's your type? Uh, not at all. Yeah, not at okay. all. Why not at all? Uh, she is, uh, she's definitely a beautiful woman. It's just uh, not initial attraction. Like everybody said this. Everybody yeah. keeps they. That's it. Oh, yeah. She been getting. Bop, bop, <laughs> Let's go bop. over here. They been busting her, your man. Name and age. Hi, I'm Zola Stone. I'm 31. Okay. And Zola Stone, why did you pop your balloon? I'm not the best cook. <laughs> um, okay. And I dated a real estate agent before, and it just kind of clashed because I work more in the entertainment music industry. Okay. And so he was just kind of. Trying to change. So you gonna me, judge him off the old way. nigga? So I know that I I shouldn't. Is this a smart know, guy? Did he grow up? Maybe try again. Just tired of Shamir, little brother. I don't know. I just he's don't have a good experience. Like. No, that's all good. I appreciate that. Thank you. Taj yeah. Mar. Now she's someone that's your type. Yes, for sure. Okay. Yeah. What well, makes her your type? So she's <laughs> uh, very beautiful. I love her eyes, and she's melanated. So that's definitely something I, I love about. Thank you. Yeah, you have beautiful eyes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> y'all have some. Y'all cats. Y'all have some Siamese cat looking kids. Y'all have some kids. You look like a damn cat. He got green eyes or whatever. Of massive scope for functionality. Oh, wicks. And it's always wicks. Every your time name and age. I'm Jojo and I'm 30. Okay. And Jojo, why did you pop your balloon? Uh, I know he said his preference was darker skin, and so I was like, okay, I'm light skin. But um, 
I, that's my preference too. So yeah, we kind of look like the same right now. Right. Twins. Right. Now, <laughs> now, 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 I do. Eyes and everything. <laughs> you guys do like baby each other. Wow. <laughs> Maybe related a little bit, right? <laughs> Where are you from, bitch? So, yeah. Okay, okay. Now, I know we just said y'all look related, yeah. but is she someone that you like? My sister. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> not really i'm going to uh say that and uh otherwise beautiful eyes Thank i you. love the hair i love the tattoos and she's beautiful overall she just uh wouldn't be my type because we do look really <laughs> similar <laughs> so, to be I... honest with you but yeah okay. overall beautiful woman thank you thank yeah. you you go with me all right so we do what have one balloon left and popped any questions for our lady here yes okay. so uh from your pat your last relationship Name one thing that you did wrong and one thing that he did wrong. Oh. Boom, Look right there. <laughs> right. Corny ass question, Fair man. I'm not going to answer that only because we're starting off new. You know what I mean? Okay. Um, I don't want to bring what was in the past into something I'm starting new. Mm -mm. That's fair enough. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Queen. So, I, what were you trying to get out of that question? So to help her better understand. Uh, what he asked? Trying to see where her head is at and see if, if there was like any issues I could kind of foresee mm -hmm. at the beginning. Okay. And you know, yeah. every relationship, it's both partners, you know, I'm not saying it was just me. Y'all not doing the TED talk. Not, not um, on my but watch. I'm not bringing something old into something new. And uh, the age of 40 in uh, the country of Mexico. 100%. We got a man. Oh, so you want her balloon back? <laughs> Take this. Yeah, and, and you guys can go on up. Let's give it up for that win. She popped when he asked. Now she <laughs> won't. You see? Get out of here. Get out of here. You see? Okay. Let's go ahead and bring I'm out our next single guy. Let's see. Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? Oh, Lord. My name is Julius. Julius, how old are you? Yes, I'm 34. And what do you pants. do? Uh, I mean, I'm an OTR truck driver. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very cool. Yes. Uh, what are some things I could do for fun? Uh, for fun, man, I do a little bit of everything. I like to play pool, uh, bar hop, comedy clubs, bar hop. paint, uh, skate rooms. Okay. Uh, shit, I know it may not look like it, but I love to eat. So different <laughs> restaurants, trying out different foods. Uh, yeah, every year I go to a different, I mean, I go to Laker games every year. So, okay. uh, yeah, you know, that's, that's pretty much it. Yeah. All right. Uh, what are some things you look for in a woman? Oh, what I look for in a woman. And I got to dig deep in my soul for this one. All right, look. So I'm looking for a woman that has not given up on love. Okay. That still believe in the process. I mean, the concept of falling in love. Because, mm. you know. Uh, and they look like black youngsters. Like every relationship is not the skinny perfect, version you know, of black youngster. Every relationship, you have your ups and downs. So, you know, I'm looking for a woman that's going to stick around. When we having our downs, mm. you know, because like uh, as long as I'm not cheating on you or putting my hands on you or disrespecting you in any type of way, any disagreements we have, we can get through that. Okay. So, you know, yeah, uh, I'm looking for a woman that knows how to think for herself. And that's, and, and that's oh, I'm sorry. Uh, and that's not going to uh, follow behind the crowd. You know, okay. right, that's right. not going to alter her opinion just to appease the crowd. So, you know, a woman that's going to stand on business. Uh, OK. Man, I'm looking for a woman that's genuine. Damn, bro, how know, much? A woman that's kind, okay. loving. <laughs> now what? Are, no, you gonna keep going, huh? Yeah, no, yeah, <laughs> hey, that nigga know what he want. Hey, ain't no wrong with that. Ain't no wrong with deal that. Deal breakers. Oh, Come on. Uh, I would say a woman that does not know how to take accountability. Mm. Boom. Uh, a woman that doesn't keep her house clean. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, if you got kids and your house is a little messy or stuff like that, like. That's cool if you got toys around, or if you got laundry piled up or something like that, that you just ha haven't got around to doing it. Okay, that's cool. But I'm talking about like, Nasty. if I go to your bathroom and behind the sink, it, it look like it ain't been, I mean, behind the toilet, it look like it ain't been touched in months. Like, that's a that's deal breaker. Different. Like, you know, IG. Okay. Because, yeah. All right. So we do not have any pop balloons. Oh, we don't? No. <laughs> so I'm actually going to go ahead and uh, switch it on over to you. You know what? Let's start off with you having uh, to ask the ladies a question. Question. Yeah. Okay. It's kind of like a three and one, maybe on, a nigga. four and one, depending on how I word the question. But uh, how long have you been single? Uh, how long did your last relationship last? And name one thing he did wrong in that relationship, and name one thing you did wrong in that relationship. See. Okay. 
We'll start here with your name and age and the answer to his questions. Time. They just that's I don't wanna hear these answers. But yeah, when it gets physical, I don't do that. So And you said he got physical, so what's one thing that you did See? in that relationship? Right. You're looking for, mm -hmm. and I like that. So I just wanted to hear more. Thank you. Okay, go ahead and ask these ladies another question. Another one, okay. Yes. Uh, based off. I don't. You don't? Mm -hmm. Okay. Is that a problem for you, a deal breaker for you? You for him. I can't do yes. it, you. Ah, is it a yes for you for her? Absolutely. We got a match. <laughs> I'll take this mic right. and you guys can go on up. Let's give it up I for I couldn't them, do it, you. You were asking too many TED Talk questions and. It was just, it was like, oh. <coughs> <coughs> they bore me. And it seemed like they were just trying to find a mate at the end. I will say they probably the, the best dudes they had up there for his matches for, like, quality dudes or um, the essential man. They had good dudes for them. The, the women choices, they was dope. Some of them was. With no um, straight up monsters up there, but overall, I mean, this is a dope episode, man. I like it, man. I like the I like the response for the dudes this time, yo. That they had something they ain't just come in, you know, trying to find the, um get some ass. That's what it seemed like. Like it seemed like the dudes was looking for mates. Yeah. Anyway. We're live on the channel every Friday night at 9 p.m. Talking about stuff just like this. You got to come through and holler at me, man. This was episode 19 of Pop the Balloon to Find Love. We're going to see what happened next time, man, on episode 20. Pop the Balloon to Find Love. So they it's probably going to be women next time because they be going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I don't know the routine or the route or the number or the whatever. Anyway, I'll let you boy. Heist man the fuck. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinion. Pop the balloon, fine love, 19. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Holla at your boy. This is a dangerous group. Is it groups that we're dealing with now? All right. This time. But I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.